Greetings all, and welcome to Animal Crossing New Leaf, a walkthrough and let's play unlike any other you've seen before. Thanks so much for watching, and don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, because it really does help us out a lot. Well, back to action! Hey, what's happening gamers? Welcome back to Animal Crossing Fridays, here on the K-Wings Let's Play channel. Oh, don't mind my IV, I just, you know, I, I needed some fluids after a long day playing video games. I think you needed some fluids because you don't have anyone around to make you a sandwich. Yeah, I'm... That's your way of feeding. <laughs> living the dream. The singles dream in Animal Crossing. <laughs> That's right. That's what happens I'm, when you don't have a lady around to take care of you. I'm malnutrition. <laughs> is that, is that, malnourished. Malnourished and, you know, I, I hardly sleep and, and or you, eat. And you're mal, mal hugged. Yeah, but uh, thanks to learning from Amber's mannequin, we now have a Sentai mannequin all ready in my zap gear, which I'm so excited about. So this is a true bachelor's pad. We got an amazing TV, we got a gamer's couch, katana blades, and all this other stuff. Yeah. Oh yeah, I forgot how much I like the, uh, the wallpaper. And also, to fit my personality, we have a goofy Samba going, because... Yeah. Oh yeah, I actually don't. Need, I can't even hear it, so I'll just have to pretend I can hear. Amber's Amber's guest room is not really coming around yet because I, I have to pay <gasps> Tom Nookamore my soul. Oh my soul. gosh, it looks kind of like the the guest room that Beast made for Belle in the you know not the yeah we're Beast. we're getting there we're getting it's there. It's so it's nice. I hope they'll let me expand it a little more because right now it just feels like a little dungeon. And uh, shout out to uh, one of our subscribers. Uh, David Birch, he was asking me about the train set, and what I did with oh, it. Oh, yeah! What did I do with the train set? <gasps> there it is! Oh, cool! There it is! It's in my weight room. Look at, look at, Yay, where's eat, it going? Eat your heart out. Where, where are you going? Where are you New going? controller one. Where are you, where are you going? So I follow my train set. It just goes around in a circle. Why does it do eat. that? Where's it going? Where's it going? <laughs> Trains are awesome. Yeah, trains are awesome. So, I, I used to love trains as a kid anyway. Um, my grandfather always used to drive me to see the trains when I was little. And apparently, like, I just had a blast, you know, giggling and drooling and all this other stuff, you know. Uh, but then when, when, I, when I became of age and uh, I was like 10 or something, Grandpa took me to comic book stores instead and I just stayed there forever and it was so cool. But, yeah, and I, I still remember that after I got married, he was like, well, I guess I can't take you to see the trains anymore. And I'm just thinking, I don't think I've seen the trains in probably 15 years. It was like, let's go do that. But Yeah, yeah. I, if you remember, I was I actually did the voice in one of David Birch's, um, he made like a little video on his channel, and I did like a voiceover for it. I, I don't For a train that. video. I, he makes train spe videos. Speaking of training, I, I gotta, uh -huh. I gotta lift. Uh -huh. No, I, that, that was one. I'm done. I got, I got like a little rippling muscle now. Just a small one. Yeah, I can see it. It's kind of, I see it there. Don't stare wow. too long. Don't stare too long. So now without... Yeah, don't stare too long. Since yeah. I got the mannequin, and the I have no idea how I got the mannequin, um, I cleared up some space here, so nice. which I'm kind of happy about. My bachelor pad is coming, coming along. And upstairs is a kid's room for, you know... Oh yeah, you're in your rock and roll gear now. Because of last episode. That's right. This is the ultimate kids room. I, I really like that blue hair look on you. Thank now you. I'm like really thinking about putting blue hair on you, real Luke. No. <laughs> no, no, no. But this is this is the perfect child's room. It's equipped with a dangerous weapon, a computer, <laughs> yeah, exactly. and a bed. And of yeah. course they got... Yeah, computers and weapons are both kind of dangerous, actually. Go so well. We're gearing up for Hyrule Warriors. What can I say? <laughs> exactly. Yeah. That's nice. You, you you thinking about you know starting a family with uh um some other Animal Crossing character? <laughs> it's totally peanut. Know. It's totally peanut. No, <laughs> no. I'm 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 squirrely in love with her. Like I'm just I've fallen I've fallen for the bushy tail. No, I think you just. <laughs> I think you just wanted her in your town to make my character jealous. What? I think you like put Peanut in your town because you're like you know. I had no, I had no. I told you I had no saying that. Let's go visit. She it. just, she just was gravitating towards your, um, your manliness so of your character. It's time, it's time for us to visit our friends. Well, I mean, I have some friends in this town, although most of them, <laughs> Rosie was one of my friends, and she moved to Amberstown. 
She's gone. So we just have Peanut, who was originally from yeah. Amberstown. If you Sorry, take... it was Amberstown. If you take my if you take my tiger away, I will be so mad. I don't think we have any original residents from when we started this in this town. I will actually I'll be madder if you take um uh what's his name? Wait. Oh my gosh, I can't remember his name. That's right, my buddy. My buddy the here. Other squirrel. This is this this guy right here. He was here since the beginning. Hello. Let's That's go. such a cool name. Hey, remember he has like that train station Yay, floor? Broccolo. He's got he's got the train carpet. Yeah. He's got the train carpet. Can't wait to see my buddy. What's going on? Wait, what? What's what? this? What's this? Where where are you going? Where's this train? Are, where's the train, man? What's going on? Oh no. What? No 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 no. You can't move. You've been here since the beginning. I like you. I like you, man. I wonder what delicious specialties there are in my next town. No, no next town. I wonder what what town he's gonna go to. Oh, he's my little comic buddy. He can't go. Oh, he collects comics. Yes, I he does. I was packing up all my comics. He already said it. Why? He like trains and comics. Aww. But. Why? You, you can't go. I'm gonna have to make more things in your town, give you more money to make more things thought, so people will stay. I thought you said that if you keep talking to them, they'll they'll change their mind. I think that's before they pack everything up in boxes. No! I think he's already no! called the UPS no! truck and I like he's this. already set up his cable uh, and, and, and phone. <laughs> he's already set up his cable and phone at the new address, changed his uh Number at the address at the P.O. box. Curse you, Comcast Easy Install. <laughs> I'm so sad. I am like a yeah, river of sadness he right actually, now. He's not. He's he actually decided to go with BIOS instead. He's not doing Comcast. He's like he's the original. He was like one of the no. first residents. You can't you can't leave me here with all, all right, these nut well, jobs. I'll try to be really mean to him if he comes to my town. You can come. This weird Joey thing is <laughs> oh, like... Oh no, you have Sylvia. What? Wait, I thought we had a kangaroo person in here before. I don't remember you. Who are you? Who Wait, are you? is this a second kangaroo you have in your town? What do you mean a second one? That's a different thought, one? Oh, I thought you had a guy kangaroo before. What, that's a girl? I don't know. They both had, like, little Joeys Wait, in their I pouch. Wait, I forget! Do the guys- Who carry, are you? Do the guy kangaroos carry the joeys or do the women? I don't know. This isn't this isn't National Geographic. How, how am I supposed to know? I, I don't, don't, I don't remember. Know what... I somehow I thought it was the guys that do it, but I don't know. I'm like a tornado of anger right now. Aww. Swirling about! I really liked last episode because you gave me all kinds of stuff. Well, I didn't know I'd lose my mouse! <laughs> I'm Aww. gone one day. I wish my character was there to give you a hug. Peanut? I guess Peanut will have to do. What? Has it been a thousand times already? What do you want to talk about, slacker? Wow, she's kind of like a You're stuck so up. mean. Oh, she's kind of like a popular. <laughs> she's, like, <laughs> she's like a... She, she's beautiful and she knows it. She's like a popular girl, Peanut. <laughs> she's so... It's like she's pretty on the outside, but maybe not so much on the inside. Not much. <laughs> There's no gooey center in the inside. Exactly. She's just mean. It's like a hard shell of evil <laughs> this can't be happening maybe if he comes out of his house oh. maybe he comes out of his house that there'll be a way to persuade him not to leave maybe we might have to time travel we might have to time travel and oh, tell him not let's, to leave that's right come on the doctor that's right let's go it's, it's gonna be it's gonna be time for the doctor to shine so we we're gonna save my little mouse buddy he's not gonna leave us not on my watch it's so sad we've got to go back how back many, how to many, the future. How many days back do we have to go to prevent him from leaving? <laughs> Maybe like a week? I don't know. A week? Make me feel better, Sable. Welcome. Thank goodness it's Friday. Oh, it's Friday right now, but oh, it'll yeah, be tomorrow. It'll be, it'll be Wednesday <laughs> exactly. or Thursday. We're gonna we're gonna save our mouse buddy. We time travel. Ah! <laughs> yeah, she looks pretty weird. Yeah, she's from your town. She was from your town, and then yeah, yeah, you. So pretty much, you take all the weird-looking animals and what you take them at my town. Sporty fishing vest. That looks so oh, lame. Oh, that looks. You would look so cute in that. No, what is this? Shopping it for a present. Looks like a '60s dress. Blue retro dress. Hmm. 
I know someone who that would work for. Do you think my character would look good in that? Oh, I was talking about Peanut. Oh, oh my gosh! Oh my gosh, you can actually buy, uh, you can actually give gifts to characters in the town. You could give that to her. You have to get wrapping paper and wrap it up as a gift, though. Or you could send it to her in a letter. You know, I've never really done the letter thing. I don't really care for it, so. But I don't want you to. I want, I want, I want you to give gifts to my character. You know, we're not exclusive, right? What? It's unbelievable. This isn't the 50s. We're not going steady. Oh my gosh. <laughs> uh, it is for me. See, see, happily married married people can joke about, like, dating, because we're not. <laughs> that, that's it. That, that period is gone. Uh, hey. so, yay. It's, the romance is dead. No, it's not. Yay! <laughs> Wait, it is? No. I don't uh, know. Is it? I don't know. Uh, let's see. I guess, well, I made I you pancakes so. this morning, so... I did, I did get pancakes today. So, I would say that it's not dead. I did get pancakes. How's it going, dude? I, I think I'm gonna try to make brownies today. Because I, I got enough coconut oil, so I have enough. Brownies Midnight Edition. Oh, yeah, and also... And yes, I make brownies with coconut oil, because it's awesome. Yeah, people, continue. People who are watching this, uh, just so you know, too, our microphone died for our console Let's Plays, so we'll be playing 3DS for about a week. Oh, and, uh, yeah. And then we're gonna have to, like, lickety-split go and, um, you know, post the videos that were supposed to be this week. For next week, so we're gonna record them in advance when we get the thing on Saturday or Friday. Your character looks so cute with his blue hair. He's very styling. But it's enough of that. He looks dapper. Enough of that. Yes, he is very dapper. He's a dapper chap. So we're gonna head to the recycling center, we're gonna sell our stuff, and then we're going back in time to save our blue little friend. You should give that guy a piece of fruit once in a while. He'll give you a new motion. I don't I don't care. Look I'm, at all the emotions I had. You know you're jelly. The, the only emotions that I have right now is sadness because, <laughs> oh wait, who's that? I've never seen you before. That's another mouse. Moose? Moose? Oh, I see, so you're the reason. So he's moving in. Or... You're, you're the reason. You're that the reason my friend is, is leaving. And the other one is leaving. Not on my watch. Mm, Broccolo is such a cute name. Get ready to run, Amber. What? That's a Doctor Who reference. Oh, oh my gosh! I'm so sorry. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I apologize. Yes, to everyone can you help watching. me? I need a new sidekick to travel through time with. Are you interested? The one sitting next to me is. Not worth She's it. She's totally married, though. She can't just, like, leave her husband and go traveling around. He needs her. She could be... Well, how will he... She could, she could be my piper. How will he eat sandwiches if she's not there to make them? You know, I actually found out that you can go to delis and they can make sandwiches for you. Really? And then wrap them up. Yep. No way. Yes way. They are... make the sandwich there? There, there are places no where way. they make the sandwich. No way. Where? They're... You can do that stop and shop? Uh, I don't know, but they like, they wrap it up and stuff, and then you take it home. Wow. Yeah. I'm no longer useful. Totally. My main purpose in life is dissipating fast. Alright gamers, join me right to now as we do some time traveling. Save quit! All right, so the TARDIS has landed. Let's see what happens to our little blue friend. It's the previous Mission. day. Stop Broccolo from leaving. Stop Broccolo, that's right. Otherwise aliens will attack the town and destroy the world. He's not listed! What? No! But I went back in time. What? I went back, not forward. I went what? back, not forward. That's unbelievable. He's not here. So so I wasted all that money on the special effects from the show. <laughs> ah, oh, life no. is unfair. Uh oh. Wait, you're saying that even if you go back in time, that the person um, will still leave? Something happened though. What? There was a switch. <gasps> Wait, I thought Bo was already in your town. No. He already took Bo from me. Isn't this a G.I. Joe guy? 
No, this is Bo. You already stole her from me before. Oh. Oh, that's right. My friend. You always take all my friends. Man. But my Dad. friend is gone. The only one I cared about. The only one I somewhat tolerated. <laughs> Bracolo. Who the heck is Whitney? <laughs> There's all women in this so town now. <laughs> It's like an well. It's like it. Maybe maybe the reason there's so many women in your town is because you're the doctor. They're all trying to get a chance to be like your companion on your TARDIS. <laughs> it wasn't worth losing my one friend. Whoa! Cool looking house. Get out of my town. <laughs> At first, I thought her door was metal, but I guess it's not. She's a wolf. I am so glad, a new friend. Wait, you're gonna get rid of my other wolf. Two of you can't exist in the same town. That's actually not true. I had, um, that one guy, that one squirrel. I had the white guy squirrel and peanut for a while in the same town. Oh, wait, no, maybe I didn't. <gasps> maybe, oh, maybe peanut moved because that other guy moved in. Hmm. They feel threatened. Okay, guys, in the comments, do you know, can you have two of the same animal in your town? Because I don't know. Yeah, they, they start having, like, territory issues. But I, but I time traveled. Oh, poor Kiwi. But I time traveled. Time I'm travel so fix sorry. everything. That's right. But sometimes time traveling makes a rift in the space-time continuum, and it makes weird things happen. Then we'll have to go back further. Maybe you just- maybe you actually made him disappear through a portal into the abyss of time. Alright! I parked the TARDIS. Let's try this again. <laughs> Little buddy! Come on, Broccolo! Broccolo? Oh, it's raining. No! That's a super good sign. This is- so sad. You didn't want to show the rain, no? Not like this, I didn't. Not like this. <laughs> Broccolo! Raindrops keep falling on my head. Stop it, that's a sad <laughs> song. I, I don't like this anymore. What is that? Oh, that's you. It's a really interesting wow. umbrella you have there. <laughs> yeah, it doesn't, looks like, doesn't fit your personality like, at I all. Like a really Davidson umbrella. What good is time to... travel if you can't save your friends? No, this is dumb. Change it, Nintendo. Make it... <laughs> Make it less dumb. I went back a week. Oh, a full week. I'm so sorry. I don't know how to console you, Luke. I feel bad. I hate this game. Oh, look. Maybe no. that psychic person could change everything. They yeah, always I kinda, fix everything. I kind of doubt it. If psychics really... <laughs> Could do their thing. I would have won the lotto by now. Yeah, exactly. Oh, I'm sorry. They don't use their powers. That's because they have no powers. That's right. <gasps> great power. Oh my gosh! Everything that I ever thought in my whole life is—you just, you, everything is just crashing down now, Luke. You just, just ruined it. Well, I just thought the theory of time travel could, you know, prevent my friend from leaving, and it turned out to be false. That's true, though. If you were really a psychic, wouldn't you just use it, like? Oh, totally. To become a millionaire by predicting like horse races and stuff like that, like in Back to the Future where he brought that book home, you know, the book that had like the Sports Almanac, where he had like all the all the, um, the outcomes of all like the sports events of that year, things like that. He was able to predict all of them. Yeah, totally. totally. Well, anyway, gamers, we've learned many things from this episode. The rain symbolizes. My very sad heart. <laughs> Aww, I feel so sad. You know, when I bet Broccolo will come back after he sees the grass isn't very much greener on the other side. Probably went to your town. Yeah, exactly. That's what I said. He'll probably come back because I don't play very much. You know, you should come visit him in my town if he's... Um, you know. I don't visit traitors. No, you know, I felt about Peanut. That wasn't my fault. I think your boy's charm worked on her. Then again, I'm double-sided, so... But anyway, <laughs> thanks so much for taking the time to watch another Animal Crossing Fridays. Aww. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. If you enjoyed this episode, let us know. 
And we'll try to do more time traveling adventures. And, but Broccolo. Awesome. With Mayor felt, the Doctor. Yes, Mayor the Mayor the Doctor. Along Z! Uh, don't forget to like, Get comment, ready and to subscribe. Run. And we'll see you next time with more AC Fridays. Have a great weekend. See ya. Bye.